rubberbandbracelet.net. Today I'm going to show you how to make a letter B loom band charm. You can download the project instructions in the description below the video. First, you will need to decide which color or colors of bands you want to use. You will need 26 bands for this project. Next are the tools to make the project. I'm going to use my homemade loom, which is just a board and two nails, and I'm going to use my paper clip as my hook. So now to start on our project. First step is to take two bands and put them on our paper clip, then take a single band and wrap it around the paper clip four times. Then slide the band down over the two bands until it is in the middle, then remove it from your paper clip. Now that you have that piece ready, it's time to weave. I'm going to grab my loom and we will start with the piece we just made for the belly of the bee first. So we will take two bands and place them on our loom in a figure eight. Then we are going to take two more bands and put them on the nails. Next we'll weave. You take the bottom band and bring it over the top band on both sides. Slide the bands down your loom to give you some space and start again. Add two more bands and weave by bringing the bottom band over the top on both sides. So with two stitches complete now, we're going to add the cross piece. Put a single band through both nails and we will take another single band and wrap it around that other band two times. Then we weave as normal and continue with the other parts of the belly of the bee. You should have seven stitches total. Next, let's start on the straight line. So we will need the piece we created with bands wrapped around it first. Thread that onto the nails, and then we will place the loops from the first piece we made on one of the nails. Then we will put two more bands on the nails. Using your hook, go through the bands, grab the bottom two bands, and pull them back through the bands and up and over the nails. We can now continue our straight piece with one more stitch. And so now we're to the third stitch. We need to connect the tummy of the bee, again, to the straight part. We need to find the single band weave and put that on the nails, and then two more bands on top. Using your hook again, go through the bands, grab the bottom two bands, and pull them back through the bands and up and over the nails. We can now continue our straight piece with one more stitch. Now we're on to the fifth and final stitch on our straight piece. We are going to connect the rest of the tummy of the bee to the straight piece. So we need to loop all four pieces of the final stitch on the tummy piece and put it on the nails. Then we will put only one band on top to close our project up with a slip knot. Using your hook again, go through the single band, grab the bottom two bands, pull them back through the loop, and up and over the nails. Now we have our bee charm finished, so let's close all the pieces together with the one band and tie it off with a slip knot. I hope you have enjoyed our project. Don't forget to subscribe to us on YouTube and to join our newsletter so you are emailed when we put up new project videos or when we have money saving coupons on our loom bands.